Everything about San Sebastian is spectacular. The harbour setting, the people, the ambience, but above all, a magical addiction to food. There aren't a lot of Basque cookbooks. No one here seems to need them. Chefs come from around the world to learn the secrets. But if they hung around the back streets, they might just pick it all up for free. Taxi Belandia may seem a little demanding, but food is a serious subject in these parts, and the pressure is on. For half of you, this door normally marks the end of the tour. For this is a closed world, a testosterone-fired society where all have one thing in common, they're not women. In two hours, Paxi must produce a gastronomic sensation for his closest friends. If I was Basque, I'd have been born with gastronomy in the genes. Because here in San Sebastian, if you're male and you can't cook, it's a social handicap that will blight your life forever. Debate over cooking technique is lubricated with some juicy blood sausages and washed down with more than a drop of the local brew. Hello. For the last century, the gastronomy clubs, dozens of them, have flourished. Evidence of memorable meals and mates past festoon the walls. Happy days. Cheers, yes, cheers. This is a moment of celebration. A great gorging with your friends. Some fabulous Spanish red. And she who must be obeyed doesn't have to be obeyed at all. For the moment at least. Everybody here can be laughed, to drink, to, uh, to chant, well, however they want. But if they are ladies, always they make a stop. No, why do you do that? Why do you just send your friend or your neighbor? Can you do that? No? And this is make big difference. <laughs> So boys can be boys, and from what I gather, the girls don't mind the time off either. At least most of them. Did I say there were no women allowed? In case you think it'll soon be adios to these bastions of blokery, the club's waiting lists have never been longer. As the night winds up, the wider world, complete with wives, will soon reclaim its men. But until then, 100 years of tradition is proudly and loudly proclaimed. Hey!